What's up, fellas? So as you guys saw, we were just fishing that small nameless creek in North Carolina. Now we're moving up to the big river. Right here in front of me, we have this place called the New River. And I got everything that I need with me. I got my net, my fishing rods, bait, night crawlers, squid, mullet, and of course McDonald's. <laughs> you know, man, gotta, gotta eat, right? You gotta eat while you fish. I don't have time to go to places and eat, you know? I'm here to fish, so I gotta buy something that is cheap and quick. All right, so yeah, we're getting here to the new river once I get there and I get everything set up. I'm gonna give you guys a view of the place. Hopefully, we're gonna catch some nice fish here today. This place is known for having some gar, bowfin, different species of saltwater and freshwater fish we're talking about brackish water right so let's let's just hope Woo, finally here i got all the stuff down here rods net burger beige the tackle box let me give you guys a view of this place it, it, i gotta tell you it's a gorgeous place man you know i don't doubt when they say that there's gar here gar catfish different types of saltwater species now now right now we are talking february right it is february water temperatures are between 45 and 55 degrees so i don't know how well we're gonna do today i don't know what is around but you can definitely see that this is brackish water when you go down here you see these logs they have little oysters on them you know so you can see right away that this is indeed brackish water all right let's set up our stuff hopefully we're able to catch some fish hopefully i will be have something to show you guys all right folks quick update i'm using different setups on all three of my rods as always i'm using braided line on these two rods right here i got a daiwa samurai with a daiwa laguna on this one st croix avid pearl with a shimano solstice 4000 and this one here i got the Cortland endurance noodle rod with my shimano symmetry this is the only one that i have fluorocarbon i'm using cut mullet on the first one squid on the second one and two pieces of cut mullet on this third one so now i'm just chilling here i'm gonna eat my mcdonald's and you know hopefully we will get some hits we will land some fish anything you know to show you guys it's my first time down here in north carolina i'm kind of exploring down here so it's kind of a hit or miss situation you know i don't know how is the fishing in february <laughs> down here in north carolina we will see i'll keep you guys updated oh, 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 oh. We got a bite, we got a bite. Fish on. Am I snagged? I'm snagged, but I had a bite. God damn. Oh, I lost the whole rig, what? Damn. Ah. It had to be on the fluorocarbon line. Damn it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Take it easy. Come on, come on. Fish on. Yeah. First fish. On. Oh, no, he got off. No. <laughs> No! Bloody hell! God damn! Oh man! I finally had one on, man! That is so frustrating. Yeah, see that? Piece of mullet. Everything seemed to be great. Yeah, me too, man. I was like, whoa, now's the time. Ah. Uh, all right, wait for the next bite. Whoa, 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 take it easy, take it easy. Fish on. 
Come on. Come on, come up. Small, very small. Even though it's small, we will take it. Today, we will take anything. What is this? Whoa, you gotta be kidding me. It looks like a catfish. What? Catfish? Yeah. Oh man, I was expecting anything else, but not a catfish. I well, can't say that I'm disappointed though. This is my first ever catfish from the New River in North Carolina. So, you know, all right, I can't, can't be that disappointed. Let's see what type of catfish this is. Oh man, hard to tell. We got a very black tail very black tail notch symmetric uh, head compared to the body is much bigger this looks like a white catfish but again could be yeah I think this is a white catfish almost sure but just in case you know I'll let my friend take a look at it too here you guys take a look at it too beautiful fish Whew. beautiful fish yeah there you go. Oh, it came out. We he came up with a little, little messed up creature here too. What is that? Is that a leech? A le well, whatever that is, it is disgusting. Check that out. It's crawling inside. Oh man. <laughs> Anyways, let's take a couple photos and release this guy. Oops, sorry. That's okay. What does this look to you? A white catfish? Certainly not a channel. Yeah, there's it's definitely be a white one. Then. There's not a channel catfish. The barbels are white, so it can't be a brown bowhead. I think it's white. I think it's a white, right? Yeah. All right, folks. Final view of our little fella. I took a few photos here. Fish is already saying, "Release me." There we go. So we're gonna release him. All right, there. Bye, bye, catfish. First fish of the day after four hours of brutal fishing I lost two bites here four total actually but only two of them were kind of good the other two were light so this was my first fish for today here at the new river man super tough of course I'm gonna continue fishing and we will see what I'm gonna catch there are some small fishes down there see they're doing some damage here i don't know if there are small fishes or crab but they're doing some damage to the mullet and as you guys can see this is the setup that i'm using for today okay two ounce sinker right with those metal rigs that you usually buy for salt water and two long size six hooks okay with pieces of mullet all right let me get this rigged again and hopefully we will land something different, something bigger, something like that. We'll see. Sean, what is this? What is this? You see folks, it was biting very, 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 uh, you know, little. And apparently it's a fish. What is this? Wow, I can't wait until it surfaces. <gasps> oh my God. Oh, it is a catfish. It is a catfish, it is a catfish. Okay, right there, right there. It was biting very, very little, you see? So there we go, we got ourselves a catfish. <laughs> okay. Second fish of the day here on the new river. We got ourselves what seems to be a brown, brown catfish. Okay? A brown catfish. I mean a brown bowhead. This is a brown bowhead, very different than the white catfish you can see from the tail already the tail is flat and symmetrical 
The barbells down here are black and not white. Color is kind of yellowish. Yeah, we got ourselves a brown ball head. Let me take a few photos. We're gonna release it. All right, fellas, I took a few photos here. Final view of our brown, brown bow head. Beautiful fish, as you guys can see. Yeah, awesome colors. First one from the new river in <laughs> North Carolina. All right, there you go. There he goes. Now, this is brackish water. So I don't know why I'm catching only catfish. What happened to all the saltwater species here? Oh boy. All right, let's see if we'll be able to catch anything else. My foot just got soaked. What happened? You fell or you stepped on the mud? This, this, my lure I was using got stuck. Like, uh -huh. from here to that post. Uh -huh. So I put rocks out to walk out on it and it slipped. Oh man. So in a minute, I think we'll be able to put it, get change of shoe from the car. Fish on. All right. Let's hope it's not a catfish. What? Let's hope it's not a catfish. I got a brown bow hat when you were gone. Yeah. They be biting. They be biting okay now. I guess the tide is coming in. You know, they, they bite very, very, uh, very, very, you know. Uh, oh, look at that. Yeah, it's another bow hat, I think. Is it? Yep, another bow hat. Oh, boy. It's a nice size bow hat, though. Yeah, it is. The other one was about was, was around this size, too. You know? You Let me out? see uh, the, the mullet. Let me see what... Let's see what type of bow head is this. He has another brown. Another brown, okay? You can look at the tail here. The barbels. Black. I don't know. The, the mouth is kind of round, too, though. The mouth is very round. Is this really a brown or is this a black? Pretty fat, too. Very fat. Well, we'll take a couple photos. We'll talk about that later. All right, took a couple photos of this fella. Let's unhook this guy quickly. And then I'm just gonna release it. At least we know that there are some bull heads around. And the bull head, you know, are willing to bite, right? That's good. I just cut the hook. You know, this guy swallowed the hook pretty deep, unfortunately. So, you know, got to cut it. Don't try to take it out, right? There is no bleeding on the sides. So the fish has a higher chance of survival. Beautiful colors, as you guys can see. Especially around the head. You see this area here? Truly gorgeous, okay? Yeah, super beautiful. All right. Time to release it. Bye-bye. There we go. Next. Pretty cool, huh? Man, is that a bite? Was that a bite or was, or was that a crab? I don't even know anymore. But it's time to check the bait anyway, so close the drag. Whoa, 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 I got a bite. Fish on! Whoa! Got a bite right on my hands! Damn! Whoa! I took the fishing rod up and the fish bit. I think it's a catfish though. Hopefully it's not, but 
you know, for the new river right now, I don't have a lot of other hopes. Let's see, let's see. What we got here? Is it a catfish? Oh boy, looks like it. At least the size of them is not as bad, you know? It is boring catfish. But at least, you know, yeah, check that out. Eh? Oh boy. It's a nice white catfish. There we go. Yeah, it's a nice white catfish. Wow. Now this size here for a white, white bowhead, you know what I mean, a white catfish is good. Yeah, edible too. I'm not gonna take it home with me, but if you wanted to, you know, you could eat it. See, beautiful. You see the, so the, the thing is the tail is not symmetric. That's the main key identifying a white catfish. This portion here is bigger than this portion here. And then of course you add, you have the head in comparison with the body is bigger, white barbels, right? Wow, okay. At least you know we landed a white bowhead. Let's take a couple photos. I'll release it. All right, just finished taking a few photos of this fish. You guys can also have a final view of our Mr. White catfish. And as you can see, this white catfish has a leech right here sucking on its barbel oh don't talk all right bro i will release you soon it has a leech right here too sucking on its tail and also a mark here right this is this is from injury all right you talk too much let me release you here bro bye Whoa. <laughs> man why is it all catfish for today huh folks i i was trying to use this too you know to catch to get some speckled trout or some red drum, you know, the little gulp on a jig head. Nothing, but we'll keep trying. It's not sunset yet, so I'll keep you guys updated. Whoa, 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 take it easy, take it easy, fish. Fish on. Fish on. <laughs> you think you can escape the Asian kid here? Think twice, fish. If you come here to eat my food, my food ain't free. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Man! Another catfish! I think so. Yep. Another catfish. Well, we're catching a bunch of catfish. This is a white catfish. We're catching a bunch of catfish here at the New River <laughs> in North Carolina. Ah, I wanted to catch something, you know, different, but you know, I can't, I can't complain. Catfish are fun to catch. We got the white catfish here. Yeah, we got enough photos for today, I think. So I'm just gonna release this fella here. Like I said, I can't complain, you know? There we go, there he goes. <sighs> Got a bite here. This one doesn't have weight on. Fish on. This one doesn't have weight on. You know, so you know, <laughs> I'm fishing this one weightless. Let's see what we got here. Come on, come to the right side. I want that. I don't want that fish to get tangled. You know. Come on, come here. What we got here? I think it's a catfish. Whoa, 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 whoa! Take it easy. Maybe it's not a catfish. Or maybe it is a good catfish. Oh man, it is a catfish. It is just a nice catfish, that's all. But it's a catfish. Here, I'll give you guys a view here. We got ourselves our culprit, Mr. Catfish. All right, let's take this fish up. Okay, come on, come up here. You know what? For this fish here, I'm actually gonna use my net 
because uh, I'm gonna use my net. Whoa, 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 <laughs> take it easy there, fish. <laughs> what? <laughs> Did you guys see that? <laughs> That's insane. The fish is not even so big, you know? Man. That is the thing about not using <laughs> rod holders, all right? Oh boy, that's funny. All right, come on fish. Come up here. Ah, that was funny. Now, not that I would risk losing my rod, but this is a nice, nice bowhead. You know, this is a nice bowhead. I used the net for it. The biggest bow, biggest bowhead of the day. Two. Fish on. We got the bow head inside my net. Yeah, what's up? What you catch? My friend, my friend got a fish. I'm a snag here, and I have a, a fish on this rod. I don't know what to do anymore. Oh boy. All right, let me unhook this guy first. This is our biggest bowhead of the day. All right. Biggest bowhead of the day. Very nice. We're gonna get a measure, a weight on this guy too. Monster. You need a net? What is it? All right, I got the net. I'm coming. Is it big? Oh, wow, dude. It's a big catfish. Can't you just get it by the hand? Uh, it's big. Huge. I don't want to hurt him. Yeah, no worries. You got that. Lip it. Lip it. Lip him? <laughs> Should I? Yeah, just be careful not to bite you. Careful not to bite you? Wouldn't, wouldn't I tell him not to? That's a nice white catfish. Once you get it clean, I'm going to take a photo of that, okay? I'm going to clean it. You know, lip it. Strong. Ooh, Put strong. it. Thumb. What I mean is, uh, after you put your hand in his mouth, click it a little bit down, so it doesn't let you, let you, let him bite you. Use strength. Like that? Yeah. Is that good? Yeah, that's good. Don't let it go. Don't let it bite you, man. Yeah. Click it. Once it's clean, because I got a fish over there too. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, no, don't worry about it. I just took a couple photos of this bowhead. I am not sure yet if this is a brown bowhead or a black bowhead. I actually need to check. But this is a nice bowhead. There's a little hand draw a scale that someone did here. We're talking about a 16 inch, okay? A 16 inch bowhead, all right? 16 inches bowhead. This is a nice sample right here. But anyways, I've taken a few photos already, you know? You guys have a final view of this fish. Super neat fish. All right, bowhead catfish. Whew. Very nice. All right, bye bye. Bye. Oh, you have one of these scales? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, I bought five pounds. Wow, Seems dude. like it's bigger than that, but. Five, dude. Yeah. This is, what is the state record here for the white catfish in North Carolina? Oh, no, it's gotta be bigger than this. this uh, Take it's a, a photo? Off, oh, dude, absolutely. Dude, a five pounder white catfish. This is the biggest white catfish that I've ever seen, man. You know, bullheads, they don't get that big. And don't forget, white catfish is native to the United States of America, yeah? So that's one of the native bowheads that we actually have here. Woo! Yeah, take a photo, take a photo, absolutely. I'm very sorry, one yeah, with my phone. Tony, it was in between the two pillars, not that far. Hold it. Look like you did before? Yeah. Let me see here, what's the best angle? All right, let's release this beast it's slowly. Nope. Put it in the water. Whoa, wake. 
took out two way too fast. Check that out. Wake from the okay. boat, man. All right, we're done with my bow, brown bow head. We're done with the white catfish, the super big white catfish. Now we have to unsnag my other rod. I usually use my pliers to unsnag my rods. It's got 30 pounds braided line. It's not going anywhere. We got a fish on here. Yeah, it is nagged, all right? But we got a fish on here though. So, all right, let's unsnag this rod and see if we can get this fish up. Oh man, did I lose this fish? It's nagged really bad. I think I may, I may have lost the fish. I don't know. Let's see. What? It's got snagged again? Oh, goodness complicated you see guys complex all right come on come on oh all right unsnagged it i don't know if the fish is still on though we'll see the fish is still on it's still on all right unsnagged it fish is still on awesome we know no new species today but at least we got some action on the new river in North Carolina today in terms of catfishing. You know, this will make an awesome catfishing video. Let's see what I got here. It's a nice catfish. Oh, oh, it's a nice one. It's a nice one, it's a nice one. And yeah, there we go, yeah? Nice, nice catfish right here. I think I got my whole rig back, I'm not sure. We got a white catfish in the range of two pounds two pounds white catfish yeah there's one hook here on the side hooked on its pectoral and there's another one in its mouth so let me unhook this guy real quick take a few photos and release it all right there we go unhook this fella no photos necessary we already have enough photos of white catfish just gonna release this folk right here bye bye until another day grow up to be big like the great grandfather that we just saw right there. <laughs> Mike, yeah. 15 more minutes, that's okay for you? That's good. All right, great. Let's catch a monster meanwhile. Yeah, it's gonna be ready soon. Whoa, there we go. god damn! Awesome. <laughs> Your first bullfin ever, two pounds, two pounds, 11 ounces. 